<sighs> All right. Hello, hello. Welcome to presumably June. Hope you all are doing well, staying healthy, getting some fresh air, spending some time outside. It is a beautiful day today, uh, and yet here I am in my basement. Not going to haul all the camera equipment outside for our last music lesson of the school year. Today, for our last music lesson, we're going to do a song tale palooza. So I'm going to do a bunch of song tales for you, and I hope you uh, enjoy them. So feel free to sing along uh, with any of them that you know. Hopefully you enjoy them. Uh, invite your family to listen as well if you wish, and maybe they'll enjoy them too. We're going to start with a classic. Will you wear red, oh my dear, oh my dear? Will you wear red, Jenny Jenkins? I won't wear red. That's the color of my bed. I'll buy me a foldy rolly tilty tilty sink a double roll. Jenny Jenkins roll. Well, will you wear blue, oh my dear, oh my dear? Will you wear blue, Jenny Jenkins? I won't wear blue. It's the color of my shoe. I'll buy me a foldy rolly tilty tilty sink a double roll. Jenny Jenkins roll. Well, will you wear yellow, oh my dear, oh my dear? Will you wear yellow, Jenny Jenkins? I won't wear yellow. That's the color of my jello. I'll buy me a foldy rolly tilty tilty sink a double roll. Jenny Jenkins roll. Well, will you wear black, oh my dear, oh my dear? Will you wear black, Jenny Jenkins? I won't wear black. That's the color of my knapsack. I'll buy me a foldy rolly tilty tilty sink a double roll. Jenny Jenkins roll. Well, will you wear pink, oh my dear, oh my dear? Will you wear pink, Jenny Jenkins? I won't wear pink. That's the color of my sink. I'll buy me a foldy rolly tilty tilty sink a double roll. Jenny Jenkins roll. Well, will you wear purple, oh my dear, oh my dear? Will you wear purple, Jenny Jenkins? I won't wear purple. That's the color of my turtle. I'll buy me a foldy rolly tilty tilty sink a double roll. Jenny Jenkins roll. Well, will you wear heliotrope, oh my dear, oh my dear? Will you wear heliotrope, Jenny Jenkins? I won't wear heliotrope. It's much too silly a dope. I'll buy me a foldy rolly tilty tilty sink a double roll. Jenny Jenkins roll. Well, will you wear brown, oh my dear, oh my dear? Will you wear brown, Jenny Jenkins? I won't wear brown. That would make me proud. I'll buy me a foldy rolly tilly tilly sink a double roll. Jenny Jenkins roll. Well, what will you wear, oh my dear, oh my dear? What will you wear, Jenny Jenkins? I have nothing to wear. I can't go anywhere. I'll buy me a foldy rolly tilly tilly sink a double roll. Jenny Jenkins roll. Always a fun one. Of course, you've probably been able to pick out the clothing you wear each day a little bit more than you used to, wearing your uniform and all. So, all right, our next one is Father Grumble. Father Grumble's a story of a, a man and a woman who live on a farm and they do lots of work, but the man thinks he works harder than the woman and she ain't having any of that. So she does his work and he does hers. And we find out who works harder. Are you ready? Oops, sorry. I made a mistake. Let me start again. Yeah, I was going to move the music a little closer. Just make sure I don't get the words wrong. There was an old man who lived in the wood, as you can plainly see, who said he could do more work in a day than his wife could do in three. If that be so, the old woman said, why this you must allow, that you shall do my work for a day while I go drive the plow. But you must milk the tiny cow for fear she should go dry. And you must feed the little pigs that are within the sty. And you must watch the bracket hen lest she should lay astray. And you must wind the reel of yarn that I spun yesterday. The old woman took the staff in her hand and went to drive the plow. The old man took the pail in his hand and went to milk that cow. But Tiny hinched and Tiny flinched and Tiny cocked her nose. And Tiny gave the old man such a kick that blood ran down to his toes. Ouch. Well, hey, my good cow, and how my good cow, and now my good cow stands still. If ever 
I milk this cow again, it'll be against my will. And when he'd milk the tiny cow for fear she should go dry, why then he fed the little pigs that were within the sty. And then he watched the bracket hen lest she should lay astray. But he forgot to reel the yard his wife spun yesterday. He swore by all the leaves on the trees and all the stars in heaven that his wife could do more work in a day than he could do in seven. <laughs> Turns out his wife worked pretty hard. And I suppose he worked hard too, but he learned his lesson, didn't he? All right, here's another one about a man and a woman. This one's one of my favorites. It's called the Deaf Woman's Courtship. Uh, the old woman can't hear very well. And the old man keeps asking her questions. And finally, by the end of the song, she hears him. And it's a pretty shocking question that he asks. Are you ready? Old woman, old woman, will you go a shearing? Old woman, old woman, will you go a shearing? Speak a little louder, sir, and rather hard a hearing. Speak a little louder, sir, I'm rather hard of hearing. Old woman, old woman, are you good at spinning? Old woman, old woman, are you good at spinning? Speak a little louder, sir, I'm rather hard of hearing. Speak a little louder, sir, I'm rather hard of hearing. Old woman, old woman, can you do fine weaving? Old woman, old woman, can you do fine weaving? Speak a little louder, sir, I'm rather hard of hearing. Speak a little louder, sir, I'm rather hard of hearing. Old woman, old woman, will you darn my stocking? Old woman, old woman, will you darn my stockings? Speak a little louder, sir, I think I almost hear you. Speak a little louder, sir, I think I almost hear you. Old woman, old woman, why don't we get married? Old woman, old woman, why don't we get married? Lordy mercy on my soul, I'm sure that now I hear you. Lordy mercy on my soul, I'm sure that now I hear you. <laughs> you usually don't ask someone to marry you on the first date, do you? That was pretty silly. All right. I'm not going to do that one yet. I'm going to do that one last. My kid's favorite. And my, one of my favorites, too. So I'll leave that bookmark there. And we did that one for most of my lessons yesterday. The frog you went a courting. Let's get that one, too. Let's go ahead a little bit. Oh, yeah, this one. Okay. <laughs> Another classic. This one's about... A man and a woman as well. A lot of song tales about men and women, right? Uh, the man goes down to the seashore to buy his wife a little crab fish. Another word for a lobster. It starts out sounding pretty somber and sad, but I have the feeling it'll get silly by the end. He was a little man and he had a little wife. And he lo loved her as much as he loves his life. Masher o do 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 deedle all the day. Masher o do 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 deedle all the day. One hour in the night, his wife grew sick, and all that she wanted was a little crab fish. Masher o do 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 deedle all the day. Mash a ro do 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 deedle all the day. So up he arose and he put on his clothes, and down to the seaside he followed his nose. Mash a ro do 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 deedle all the day. Mash a ro do 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 deedle all the day. Oh fisherman, oh fisherman, can you tell me? 
Have you a little crabfish you could sell to me? Mash a road, oh road, oh deedle all the day. Mash a road, oh road, oh deedle all the day. Oh yes, oh yes, I have one, two, and three. And the best of them I will sell to thee. Mash a road, oh road, oh deedle all the day. Mash a road, oh road, oh deedle all the day. So he caught him, and he bought him, and he put him in a dish. And he said, oh wife, put your nose to this. Mash a road, oh road, oh deedle all the day. Mash a road, oh road, oh deedle all the day. Then his wife, just a smelling, popped up in her clothes. And the crabfish popped up and grabbed her by the nose. Mash a road, oh do do deedle all the day. Mash a road, oh do do deedle all the day. Oh, help, dear husband, uh, come hither, do you hear? But the crabfish had already grabbed him by the ear. <laughs> Mash a road, oh do do deedle all the day. Mash a road, oh do do deedle all the day. And so, my friends, if for a crabfish you thirst, please try and remember to cook him first. Mash a road, oh, do, do, deedle all the day. Mash a road, oh, do, do, deedle all the day. That's pretty silly, right? I just imagine the man and woman and the crab right between them, holding one ear and holding the other's nose. It's pretty funny. All right. All right. I think we have about three left. Three song tales to go. That one, that one, and that one. Of course, for this one, we're not going to use the uke because this one we're going to do the motions to. So we're going to do laundry. So we're going to do laundry all week. It takes us, right? So Monday morning is washing day up and down. Twas on a Monday morning when I beheld my darling. She looked so neat and charming in every high degree. She looked so neat and in below a washing in uh, of washing of her linen. Oh, dashing away with the smoothing iron, dashing away with the smoothing iron. She stole my heart away. Tuesday is starching day. Starch over here and starch over there. It was on a Tuesday morning when I beheld my darling. She looked so neat and charming in every high degree. She looked so neat and nimble below a starching of her linen. Oh, dashing away with the smoothing iron. Dashing away with the smoothing iron. She stole my heart away. Wednesday is hanging day. Hang over here, hang over there. It was on a Wednesday morning when I beheld my darling. She looked so neat and charming in every high degree. She looked so neat and in below a hanging out her linen. Oh, dashing away with the smoothing iron, dashing away with the smoothing iron. She stole my heart away. Thursday is ironing day. Iron over here. Iron over there. It was on a Thursday morning when I beheld my darling. She looked so neat and charming in every high degree. She looked so neat and in below a ironing of her linen. Oh, dashing away with the smoothing iron. Dashing away with the smoothing iron. She stole my heart away. <sighs> Friday is folding day. Fold over here. Fold over there. It was on a Friday morning when I beheld my darling. She looked so neat and charming in every high degree. She looked so neat and in below a folding of her linen. Oh, dashing away with the smoothing iron. Dashing away with the smoothing iron. She stole my heart away. Saturday is airing day. Air it out. Put your in there. It was on a Saturday morning when I beheld my darling. She looked so neat and charming in every high degree. She looked so neat and in below a airing of her linen. Oh, dashing away with the smoothing iron. Dashing away with the smoothing iron. She stole my heart away. Sunday is wearing day. Up, zip it up and down. It was on a Sunday morning when I beheld my darling. She looked so neat and charming in every high degree. She looked so neat and in below a wearing of her linen. Oh, dashing away with the smoothing iron, dashing away with the smoothing iron. She stole 
my heart away. Bum, bum. <laughs> Always fun to do the laundry, right? Okay, we've got two more songs to our song tale of Palooza. And the next school year, we'll learn some new ones. Some fun new ones, yeah. All right, this one is a quick little one. This is another silly one about uh, my friend, old Joe Clark. Go down to his house and there's some weird stuff going on. Fare thee well, old Joe Clark, fare thee well, I say. Fare thee well, old Joe Clark, ain't got long to stay. I went down to old Joe's house, met him at the door. Shoes and stockings in his hands, his bare feet on the floor. Fare thee well, old Joe Clark, fare thee well, I say. Fare thee well, old Joe Clark, ain't got long to stay. I went down to old Joe's house, never been there before. He slept on the corn shuck bed, and I slept on the floor. Fare thee well, old Joe Clark, fare thee well, I say. Fare thee well, old Joe Clark, ain't got long to stay. I went down to old Joe's house, he told me to come and eat. I drank all the curdled milk and he ate all the meat. Fare thee well, old Joe Clark, fare thee well, I say. Fare thee well, old Joe Clark, ain't got long to stay. Old Joe Clark, he had a wife named Mary Lou. She had two great big brown eyes, the other two were blue. Fare thee well, old Joe Clark, fare thee well, I say. Fare thee well, old Joe Clark, ain't got long to stay. Old Joe Clark, he built a house, told his friends it's neat. He built the floors above his head, the ceilings under his feet. Fare thee well, old Joe Clark, fare thee well, I say. Fare thee well, old Joe Clark, ain't got long to stay. That's one of those songs that you get together with a bunch of friends for a meal or a drink. And that's the kind of song you, you everyone knows the refrain. And then everyone can take turns adding a verse, uh, you know, improvisation. Of course, I could try to improvise one right now, but <laughs> it might not go very well. So I'm not going to. But that, that could be your homework for the summer. That's your homework. I want you to make up a verse of Old Joe Clark. Whatever you're going to sing about Old Joe Clark's house. I went down to Old Joe's house, climbed the chimney. Because then I got to rhyme with chimney. Oh. I got all the way to the top and then I scraped my knee. Fare thee well. <laughs> see? You see, I made something up. So sometimes it's gibberish. Sometimes it's kind of trying to find something funny to sing about. Okay. Here's the last one. You probably knew it was coming. You probably know it's one of my favorites. So we are going to sing Mama Buy Me a China Doll. 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 Do mommy do. Where will we get the money? Hmm. We could sell daddy's feather bed. We could sell daddy's feather bed. We could sell daddy's feather bed. Do mommy do. But then where will dad sleep? Dad can sleep in the horse's pen. Dad can sleep in the horse's pen. Dad can sleep in the horse's pen. Do mommy do? Then where will the horse sleep? Huh. Horse can sleep in sister's bed. Horse can sleep in sister's bed. Horse can sleep in sister's bed. Do mommy do? Well then where is sister gonna sleep? Sister can sleep in the baby crib. Sister can sleep in the baby crib. Sister can sleep in the baby crib. Do mommy do? And then where's the baby gonna sleep? Baby can sleep in the kitten's bed. Baby can sleep in the kitten's bed. Baby can sleep in the kitten's bed. Do mommy do? Well then where are the kittens gonna sleep? The kittens can sleep in the chicken coop. The kittens can sleep in the chicken coop. The kittens can sleep in the chicken coop. Do mommy do? Well, then where are the chickens going to roost? Hmm. Chickens can roost on grandma's chair. The chickens can roost on grandma's chair. Chickens can roost on grandma's chair. Do mommy do? Well, then where is grandma gonna sit? Hmm. Grandma can sit in the piggy pen. Grandma can sit in the piggy pen. Grandma can sit in the piggy pen. Do mommy do? 
Well, then where are the pigs going to sleep? The piggies can sleep in my own bed. The piggies can sleep in my own bed. The piggies can sleep in my own bed. Do, mommy, do. Well, then where are you going to sleep? I can sleep in my mommy's lap. I can sleep in my mommy's lap. I can sleep in my mommy's lap. Do, mommy, do. Do, mommy, do. Do, mommy, do. you enjoyed our song tale palooza i hope you finish out the school year strong and that you have a safe and wonderful musical summer and uh, we'll see you in the fall take care bye